Hello and welcome to Active Future. My name is Charlotte Fares. So today I'm going to be showing you some exercises that you can perform before you go out to do your gardening. So many of us go out to our garden and we spend hours digging away, preparing the garden, making it look beautiful, and then spend the next two or three days complaining of aches and strains in the back regions or legs or shoulders. So I'm going to show a couple of exercises that you can do just before you go out in the garden to prepare the body of what is to come. So we're going to stand with our feet hip width apart and just bring the hands down in front. Stand up nice and tall with soft knees. And we're going to just gently lift the elbows up towards the ears, the hands come to the chest and down. So this movement, this sort of upright row movement, is also like a pulling up, which we could be doing with digging, with a spade, pulling up weeds. So it's a kind of functional movement that we're waking up the shoulders, we're waking up the back, preparing it for the garden. Good, one more. And then we're gonna go on to just one side. We're gonna include a rotation. So we're gonna lift the elbow and go around the back. So we're working a bit more of the shoulder joint and working a little bit more of the upper back. So we lift, we pull back and again. So we're going to do two more and then you've got an option to perhaps make those circles a little bit bigger, but keep within a safe range of movement for you. And straight away, you can probably feel that work already. So on the other side, we lift the elbow and then we start small. Just feel the rotation in the shoulder, pulling it back and down. And we just do a couple more. If you want to make it a little bit bigger, you've got an option to really take the arm round. Well done, good. So the next movement I'm going to show you is a bit of a knee bend with a stretch across. And again, a reaching action. So we bend and we reach. We pull the tie muscles in, we come back up. Bend and reach, come back up. Good, keep going. Bend and reach, good. So we're going off to the side. We've got that lean, that stretch to the right. Come back up, one more. And then we're gonna head off over to the left side. So we angle the body. We reach, tummies in, and I'm going to be constantly reminding you about pulling the tummies in. Because when you're gardening, it's really important to support the back by engaging the tummy muscles to move the trunk from place to place. One more. And then we're going to keep it simple, we're just going to reach forward. So we stretch through the back, lift the chest, tummies in the whole time. I'm always engaging my tummy muscles, pulling them in to help lift me nice and tall. One more. Good. So we'll go through those again. Hands in front. We lift up. We're going to go four of these. We can go a little bit faster if you like to. Well done. Last one. And then the right arm. Lift the elbow. Rotate it gently or take it a little bit bigger circles or maybe take the arm all the way around. Just keep breathing. Last one. And on the other side, it's a lift and up. Good. Lift. Remember, keeping that safe range of movement for you. Well done. And last one. Great. And then the reach. So bend, tummies in and stretch. Good. We really push the hips, hips in, tummies in. Well done. Last one. Good. We'll come centre. Excellent. Two more. Chest is up. You're doing really well. And then off we go to the left side. Stretch. And an option, if your knees are not keen on doing lots of bending, just, just go for an overstretch. Just to wake up this side of the body. Feel that stretch. Well done. So I'm going to show a lunge. And again, this action is again, you lower yourself down towards vegetable patch to pick up a pile of grass or leaves. Okay, so I'm alternating a lunge. Drop the back knee as we lower the body down. And this is hard work on the legs. And you need to be aware that often the legs have one, one leg is normally stronger than the other. So when you are going down, just see which leg feels the strongest. So when you go down, you put that strong leg down and forward 
and then you can reach and come back pulling in those tummy muscles good well done i think you're just about ready to get out into your gardens now just one more thing i would like you to be aware of is looking after your back remember the trunk is worked by the muscles of the back and the front so when you are reaching to pick up something heavy engage those tummy muscles pull them in and then help with the knees straightening not the back and the tummy's in it helps support the lower back muscles to avoid any aches and pains or pulling or straining just preventing injuries better still if you have got some large heavy objects in your garden that are a bit awkward to pick up ask somebody in the house to come out and give you a hand it's better to look after yourself rather than coping with an injury okay well thanks very much for joining me today I hopefully I'll see you a bit later for some post gardening stretches. Have a nice time in your gardens. See you later. Bye.